We just got our 2020 Kona electric back from a service from Hyundai and they highlighted a couple of issues. One of which is the 12 volt battery is low. We'd been getting a warning on the dash, so we kind of knew that already. And the other was wipers and that's basically it. Everything else is done. So I'm gonna show you how easy it is to change the 12 volt battery because you could pay Hyundai to do it or else you could get it yourself for very cheap and do it in like five minutes. You literally need just two tools. Your ratchet wrench and a 12 mil and a 10 mil. That is it. Anybody can do this if you have the tools and the tools are very cheap. You just flip that, oh, flip that up. Here on the positive terminal, you do that one first and undo that 10 mil and I loosen it off and then you can take off that terminal. Do the same with the negative side. And then here are your two 12 mil bolts. One here on this side and one here on this side. And then you'll be able to lift that out and replace it with a new one. This is the battery that I've chosen. I bought it in Halfords. There is about three different batteries available in Halfords. This is the kind of most expensive one and the, the highest spec one. So it has um, more ampage and cold cranking amps and all that kind of stuff. Uh, so it should last a little bit longer. UASA is also a very good brand. So let's get this done and changed out. and in that literally took all of about less than five minutes three minutes let's say uh, the battery itself costs about 120 euro i don't know how much high end i can ch will charge you but it guaranteed it's been a lot more than that so do it yourself it's super easy and just to double check everything is installed correctly i'm just going to power on for the first time after replacing the battery and see if any warning error messages come up Nope. So there you have it. No specialist tools required. No connecting to computers. Nothing like that. Super easy. Slant.